Hello everybody, and welcome to Scratch Hunting. This is Aphalord, and this is The Mast, a game uh, I saw recommended on our profile, but not only there, people already saw it in the Scratch Hunting Discord and um, checked it out and stuff, and it looked kind of amazing. <laughs> as some scratch games do and you can see it for yourself here you can see uh, by the way it's a 3d game uh, on scratch or made with scratch which comes with its uh, you know limits I, I wouldn't dare setting the resolution with my with my number keys here to anything higher than two <laughs> say one um because that would be insane it, it, it i'm not going to show you the the fps there but it, it doesn't run that well um this is on turbo warp of course because um almost normal scratch does not run it that well and uh we find ourselves as you can see here in the starting uh, a space here. You're currently situated in a pod. I used the opportunity to set my settings. Um, I also used the opportunity to see how I can change the resolution and stuff. You can also do it here. You can toggle FPS meter if you like. I'm gonna leave it off. I think it's for like this seems like it's gonna be a very atmospheric game, if you can call it that. And for that. I want the full immersion. Uh, you can toggle a speedrun timer. I'm going to leave, leave that to Kieran. Um, but yeah, I'm just looking at the style. Oh, interesting. What do these look like when they're... I'm going to leave it to this one. I think this one is quite stylish. Uh, but yeah, have you ever seen a scratch game? in 3d with this like level of i'm gonna call it detail the scratch this is detail um it's kind of crazy pod temp temperature 22 degrees celsius um do i know what that is in degrees fahrenheit probably not outside temperature 25 it's a little warmer outside this is about the temperature we have in germany right now by the way quite nice can run around not have to worry about anything continue to game you won't be able to return to this room goodbye room it was nice knowing you um oh full resolution textures requires one minute to load you know what if there is stuff to load then i'm gonna skip it but apparently that went pretty quickly metadata incomplete Or did it not work? So this worked. We have a little animation here. And now we do have the FPS timer. I apologize for that. Oh, we they even did the little like cutscene black bars top and below view automated logs critical error 4a critical stasis failure repair required refer to maintenance handbook for more information sure it's a lot of hours you were in stasis apparently for a long time well, facility in low power mode, that's not cool. Special lighting and systems available only. Restore power via electric room. Thank you. It's quite useful information to give to somebody. All operations seized planet wide. Details available on operations room of floor two. Outpost main complex building. Will I remember this? Most likely not. I'm a guy who forgets things easily. 
I thought I could turn the AC on. Wouldn't that be crazy? But no, they said specifically lighting and not much else. Resolution 2? Yeah, okay, resolution 1 is new. These cases. So all of these are locked. We move around, by the way, with WASD. And I drag with my mouse. It's no, um, like the mouse isn't set to the middle, locked to the middle. Cool boy. Gotta say, I'm no. So, no, that's just that. I'm not sure if this like qualifies as a horror game. I don't think it does. It's like just a mystery game of sorts. And I think Scratch wouldn't allow for that. We can start a generator. I'm gonna do just that. Do we have animations? Oh, all right. Generator is running, that's quite nice of it. And this is so well done. The sounds even come. How did, how did they do that? That's incredible. Directional sound? How the heck do you do that? Oh, by the way, I can run. Haha. <laughs> Got to mention. Can run. I want to view stasis info. Oh, that is good to know. A map. I want to view. Can I view another page? Probably not. Number three has a failure right here. Probably something interesting in there. Man, this is cool. How the heck do you do this? I'm out of here. Elevator. Emergency exit. Emergency exit we can't use. Let me use the elevator. Nothing bad could ever happen in an old elevator that was just powered again. Right. Oh. Teleported me. I apparently can't go back. That's also good to know. It's the stairs. No. These are closed too. We're not getting stairs. And yes, you already saw it. Um. This is brilliantly done. That is the mast. Right there. Look at it. It's beautiful. This truly is a... an atmospheric game. New food storage notice. Stocks at critical levels. Resupply needed. No supplies available on site. Sure. That could never be a problem. I see no hunger meter, so keycard nice, by the way. As far as I'm concerned, I'm a robot that doesn't ever need to eat. status facility in low power mode all operations seized planet wide we've heard that last atmosphere measurement 56,600 standard hours ago <laughs> there's some joke to be had here with standard hours and premium hours I don't know. reported atmosphere conditions poor 
Visibility below 500 meters at altitudes up to 10 kilometers. High wind gusts, high temperature, toxic cases, gases, gases, <laughs> gases uh, detected. No spacecraft or aircraft transfers to be made due to high risk limit exposure to atmosphere. All crews not evacuated are to remain indoors. I shall not. No conditions improve. Wait for rescue. Emergency communications must be made via BLM. Something. Something tells me I'm not getting rescued anytime soon. Mostly because this game wants some drama here. Oh, still cannot access that, sure. No key card will get you to the emergency exit. I hope you don't hear a lot of clicking, by the way. Like, mashing my keyboard. Also, I don't know how long this game is either. Usually I make these, like, videos about half an hour long, but... I'll pulse archives. I cannot click this, by the way, just in case somebody's wondering, why does he do this? I'll pulse map. Is that the mass BLM? Oh, that is just beautiful. Girl site monitoring system. Oh, yes. Something happened. <laughs> that is brilliant. Kapow. Yeah, sure. <laughs> all, all according to plan there. Um, but yeah, if, if this takes longer, I'm, I might just split it up or something. Um, we'll see how much time I have on my hands here anyway. But you're not here to hear me talk about How life has been taking up time. You're here to see what's up with the dang mast. Walking through corridors does it. I cannot enter the conference room. I can't enter the print room. Here I'm at home, man. Hail I'm info. There we go. Oh, that is beautiful. <laughs> it stands for very large mast. The main communication system for all installations within 300, 300 kilometers additionally provides communication off planet. That is brilliant. It consists of a 2.6 kilometer tall superstructure topped by a spire antenna, making a total height of 3.5 kilometers. That is big. Three sets of three guy wires. <laughs> I thought three sets of three guys hold the structure upright. Some very strong dudes out there holding this mass together and I just realized like a thing wow no access warning atmosphere conditions poor I see oh, we're getting some more dramatic music a little epic laboratory wing Closed for repair, and that's going. Um, I realized, by the way, when you sometimes like watch somebody play a game, you're like, why aren't they reading that, or why aren't they doing that? Sometimes, like, there's this weird feeling of, is this gonna be entertaining? Will I just be reading this entire thing? Um, lab and lockdown, no research taking place. Sure. Um, like, there's this balancing act you do when you're recording something. It's not just, like, I'm here to have fun and just enjoy this game for what it has to offer and what it is. Sometimes that little thought creeps into your head where you're like, well, other people do that too. I'm just going to walk here for a second, just in case I missed something. Which is also the other, yeah, there we go. Input passcode. Could have been, could have been that, wasn't it? But sure. 
locked. Locked. Oh, something loaded. This is so cool, man. All these little loading bay alts locked. It's a small lab. I like our small lab. There we go. That there we go. Wasn't sixty nine sixty nine was eight oh two three. Remember to lock the door. This is this is the kind of stuff that makes a game for me. It's like just the little things. Yeah, there we go. I, I know where to go. I was just before you start saying, "Oh, Apple Lord didn't forgot where it was already." Eight oh, wait, no. <laughs> two three. <laughs> it was two three. <laughs> For a second, I thought I forgot, and that would have would have been very ironic and very funny. Service tunnel only. Do not transfer railway supplies through here. Thank you. I. Am I a railway supply? What am I? That's the question I'm asking. Just waiting for a head crab or something to jump at me. Storage bunker locked. Sure. Enter tunnel platform. Oh, <gasps> that's a railway. Yes. Storage bunker door is locked as well. South to ACSW4 drill site. Ignition. You know what? It's time. Oh, I can't. I can't move on here. That would have been amazing. But no, this is already like. Wow. May I? Oh, it, it doesn't do well. Changing the resolution to one there was could have been cool, but no. So will this thing explode or something? Anything? Nice oh, chilling. Five thousand six hundred something hours, and since that thing exploded, we're still doing well apparently the drill site exploding didn't do anything to this but where are vehicles using this loading point I shall not oh well now we're just straight up locked okay thank you am I hearing What's that song called, Mr. Raider? Call and Mr. Raider. Call and Mr. That's that. That's what this sounds like. Is all I'm saying. I'm not. I'm not saying that's what it is, but I'm gonna check this place out first. It's a. It's a Bob. Mass supply station. Did I look through here last? No, that was that was very far away from this. Hmm. Come on, let me let me do something here. Apparently not. There's like proper like borders that I cannot go over. I wonder how long this took to make. It's a classic. Entry crane control panel. Cannot do anything with it though. Oh, it's a certified pop at this point. Beep, 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 beep. Open main door. Oh, it's it's, <laughs> it's that pixel back there. That's the main door. Maybe I should not. Have. Oh, hello. We could go to the mast. Now I just didn't see that place before, so I'm gonna I'm gonna keep this in mind. 
<laughs> Never mind, we're stuck. We're stuck. Um, well, I, I chose this. And here I am. Another little animation. Probably. Okay, I'm even, like, locked out of viewing anything besides this. Okay, this resolution, again. I hope I have, like, a spacesuit on, at least. That'd be nice. I'll move the mouse away so you can see. Us getting closer to this VLM, aka the very large mast. But we're fast. But we're fast now. Like something's about to happen. Tunnel! They're hitting us with a tunnel? here we at the uh, can't read that no, nothing enter are we in the mass now one would assume so given we just steered towards it Monitoring systems should not go in there. Generator room. Look, if, if you let me out again, I'm good. You do. Okay. Okay, this is generator room proper. That I cannot use though. Or can I? Power on BLM. Maintenance systems. Yes. Surely that... That's a good idea. No spinny parts. Where did I come from? I think I came from there. Hmm. Sure did. Are some things on lock now? Yep. That is still locked, though. <clears throat> could, have, could have put an elevator music in here. Oh, there. Service floor. Are we at the service floor right now? I think we are. Here's some like Twilight by Yellow. No? Okay. Could have could have used that is all I'm saying. Thank you. Wasn't that wasn't that bad? Alright. Slightly windy. Lock elevator switch room. Standby. Operation mode. 
spawn, I guess. Is that power to off or standby? Oh, I see. Switch operation to neutral. Switch power to on. Switch operation to on. Will trigger audible tone. Thank you. Ensure door is closed before using elevator. This is the elevator. Okay, hold on. Let me, let me, before I do anything else, man. I, I keep getting ahead of myself here. It's, it's a classic. Not knowing what... Oh, yeah, okay. I believe we're on the mast. <laughs> but... Far and wide, nothing to be seen. Not even that railway we came with. What was this? Error. Thank you. <laughs> this place is working just as intended. Okay, so what was it again? Power to off or standby. Neutral. Switch power to on. Switch operation to on. And ensure the door is closed. Hey. No problem. How do I how do I I'd like to I like to close the door. Can I can I close the door from I'd like to. Oh, I cannot. It's like. <laughs> Come on, man. I know I gotta ensure the door is closed, but like, how do you ensure a door is closed when? Should I have done it before? Is the trick that? Yeah, close the door. I thought of this. Okay. Look. All you gotta do is close the dang door. Resolution a little for my own sake. Okay. I'd like to like go back or something. Maybe could have only done it before, but apparently not. No, you really cannot. This is the problem. Do anything in here? This is like a puzzle. <laughs> it might be where this ends. Service door is open. I get it. Look, I get it. I get it. Why? Why did it? What's the problem with that door being closed there? I just don't understand. Turning up the resolution a bit again for you. in full HD that's what that is right this is full HD my TV ain't HD that's real so on and so forth wow this thing is that high up First of all, I'm amazed I'm not being, like, blown away here. 
Surface Floor 3, Observation Platform, an Atmosphere Monitoring System. 1.8 kilometers, yeah. That's quite the distance we traveled. what happened to the very large mast as we like to call it it's time for resolution 3 as we get to more dense places here okay Oh, this is this is what what's gonna happen here. Wow. Nothing to click, nothing to see. Open door. Are you sure? Let's get to the landing pad. Ugh. I assure you it's gonna be a landing pad like you've never seen it before. Uh-huh. Like I hope me talking less. Exit. Okay. Stairs to off-planet communication control systems. Let me, before I do anything, let's check out this sick landing pad. Maybe take a leap. No, okay. Can't even. Dude, we're so close to the top. There's the sun. Does it move? No. Probably could have looked at the sun the whole time, but never chose to. Okay, that's where I came from, I guess. But hold on a second. I just thought we came from here, but no. This is another stairway. That we haven't been to yet. Because we went up here by. Is that correct? We went up here by the elevator. Watch me get lost on this very large mast. Mighty boring out here. Glad I found it though. Anything, nothing to be seen here? No. It's the same place I Yeah, okay. So let's exit, or enter rather. And hopefully. Off planet communication control systems. Nothing here, nothing here. Did aliens break the whole dang thing? Access system, communication control terminal. I'd like to initialize it. Standby power available, no faults detected. Hey, for once, connecting high voltage supply, no faults detected, wow. Full power available, antenna module sales test in progress. Connection failed. Hmm. Hmm. That's disappointing. Use system info. Main communication terminal lighting off. 
limited communication. Power consumption, okay, that's cool. Sent by power available. Uh, I'm not gonna send one right now. I think I have to. <laughs> I have to send one right now. Send me a distress signal. Requesting rescue from BLM service landing pad. One person uninjured. How did I? No, did I type that? Additional details none. Message broadcast received by Star System Network. Relaying to nearest crew capable of exist uh, assistance. <laughs> Request accepted by one spacecraft. The Bronta 17. My saver. Savior. So, okay, yes. So, capable. Ensure that the landing site is clear of debris and lighting is provided if possible. Uh, going to be slightly difficult, but sure. FWD loading ramp available below cockpit. Hours until rescue. Okay. We're, we're waiting. That was quick, man. Six hours or eight hours just to... What happened? I thought we were on Mars and we had to like get some saving spaceship from Earth. Do I have to go back to the landing thing? Probably, right? So cool. Stairs to off land. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I hear a thing. Oh, it's dark. Oh, boy, is it. Spacecraft. be mighty cold around here. Oh, that is so cool. I should probably not be here like this close. Wow. Hello. Did it like stop? Or is it better to keep the thing on? Oh yes, there we go. Wow. <laughs> I feel like there was a missed opportunity at some point where I went into that second railway system to the mast to see whatever happened on like the drill side and stuff. Wow. But you can figure that out for yourself if you like. Unless this is like gonna be some cool like space fight now? No, probably not. I think I know this game by now. That's so cool though. Quick resolution of one. Follow them on Scratch if you want to see more of this. Honestly, like... Kind of a new era for Scratch games we've seen recently. And that's like... I have completed the game to reset the gameplay back. Thank you. Um, probably mostly due to Turbo Warp, right? Like being so great at running like complex scratch games and allowing people to make bigger scratch games like this kind of insane
thank you for watching. Um, if you want to give this a whirl, obviously intended on my part to keep some stuff out. No, I'm kidding. But if you want to check that out, of course, please do. And uh, subscribe if you want to see us play more stuff. I always enjoy these solo playthroughs and I hope you do too. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.